Okay, so for this look, what you want to do first is put on the base. This is NYX's Milk Chubby Pencil. Okay, and then what you want to do is take it and blend it with your fingers. Ha! Oh, spirit fingers. Okay, so once that's all nice and blended, um, you want to take, basically we're going to go um, through the rainbow, more or less. Um, you want to take a true red shadow. If you really don't have true red, you could use pink too, but this is my eyes, lips, face palette right here. And it's going to be whoop, that red color on the bottom. Okay, so you want to take the true red color, this teeny tiny brush right here, and um, do you want to put it, do you, you want to put it on the, we're going to go from, yeah, left to right, so put it on just your inner corners. So, okay, so that's the first. And then you want to take either like a orange or, I mean, not everybody has orange in their palettes, and I realize this, um, but you want to take some sort of like peachy or orange color, and again, I'm using this palette a lot today. Ah! Ah! Okay. Don't smash your fingers in your palettes. That's another tip. Um, alright, so. Right below that red is an, right above that red is, is an orange that I'm going to use. And you basically want to take the same brush and do the same thing. Dip it in. And this orange is... Not as orange as I would like it to be, but whatever. We're going to deal with it today, because that's how we roll. And you just want to put a little bit out right next to the red. Um, don't blend this in just yet. We're going to do the blending later, so. Okay, so then what you basically want to do is um, <clears throat> take, go through the rest of the colors of the rainbow up to green on your lid. Um, I basically just use this brush, the tiny brush for my lids, and then I'm going to go back and blend with another color later. I warned you this look was insane, so cool. Um, Okay, so okay, so for the yellow, I'm going to take Maui Waui by Urban Decay, and it looks like this. This is my giant ass palette. It's that one right there. Um, boop. I'm going to take that on the same brush and brush it right next to the to the um, orange. Kind of overlapping it, but but still, like I said, next to it, not blending it in. Okay, so after you add the yellow, you want to go on to green. This, this little shader brush, it's a flat, it's a flat one from Sonia Kashuk, and um, you want to place a bright green in there. Um, I'm using from the same palette, I'm using Kush. Yes, hilarious name, I know. We are going to take that on this brush. Tap off the excess because there's a lot of excess. 
put on some more because that's how we do things around here. And then tap off the excess again. Um, you basically want to put that on the very outside corners. Whoo, that puppy's bright. Whoo, okay. And then you want to start blending it up toward your crease. I'm going to go all the way into it because we're going to add the blue and the purple with it later. So I'm hoping you guys can see this. Okay, so for the blue, we are going to go back to the very, very tiny pointy brush that we were using earlier. Um, this is, a, I meant forgot to mention, this is also from Sony Kashuk, it just doesn't have a name. So, yeah, tiny brush. That's its name. Um, and then we want to take a bright, bright, bright blue shadow. Okay, so putting on the blue... You want to put on the same shader brush, like I said, and pat that in. This is super, super pigmented, so you want to be careful with how you apply this. Um, you want to put that right up in your crease. See, you can already see, like, this is totally freaking pigmented. Um, and don't blend it all the way, just do the little middle section. So you're basically going around your eye with color. And now you look like a parrot. So, no, it doesn't... Once you blend a little bit, it doesn't look that bad. Um, you want to take a bright purple. Again, this is very pigmented. Psychedelic Sister, my favorite purple on this universe. From Urban Decay, right there. Where I'm tapping. And they... If you are interested in Psychedelic Sister or Radium, which are my two favorite, like, bright colors, they sell them individually, too, so, yeah. Um, you want to take that color, and you want to go tap the excess off, because that will be a lot of excess, and go right, kind of next to the red, but, like, blend it back. So, boop, in your crease, and kind of blend it with the blue. Found it, um, <laughs> a clean blending brush, and go right on your crease and blend a little bit, just like upward, blend upward a little bit is what I'm trying to say to you. Be very careful with this because you run the risk of the colors looking very muddy if you blend too much. Which I may go back and add some colors now, so. Black Rocket Volume Mascara. Use it. Okay, so the weird thing about this tutorial is I'm doing the foundation last, or next to last. Um, I'm using my usual Rimmel BB Cream, dabbing it on the back of my hand like so, dotting it all over my face, dot dot dot. Oh no! Now I blend this sucker in. Brush! Okay, so... I'm really not going to use any blush because obviously this, this eye and the lip that you see is going to come is really extravagant and there's not a, not, a, not a lot of need for it. 
What I'm going to do for that is combine two products. Stila's Lip Gloss in Raspberry Sorbet, which is making me crave some actual Raspberry Sorbet right now. And NYX's Extreme Lip Cream, it's not lipstick nor is it gloss, in... It doesn't have a name. Okay, in no name. Number one, okay? It's number one. Um, and you basically want to put that on. Okay, and then you want to put a teeny tiny bit of the Stila lip gloss in the middle of your lip. Actually, hold on, we forgot a step. You want to blot your lipstick because this is really bright. And you want to blot it just in case. There you go. And then you want to take the Stila lip glaze and And then you should be good to go. Um, I don't know. I just kind of like this look. I wouldn't wear it out every day. But I think for the color on tomorrow, in a sea of white, you can see me running with my knee socks majestically through the road with a golden, purple, blue, green lip eye combo on. So anywho, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And it was just really fun to make, honestly. I had a really good time just putting this all together and hey who doesn't like a bright lip and a crazy ass rainbow eye I do um I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you next time